What is up, champions? Great J-Man Gaming here. Welcome to the new MLC Hall of Fame Spectacular. And, of course, so we're doing our Talent Up video. I did get the Lawler Starter Pack. Uh, two reasons. I think for free-to-play, he's really good. I haven't seen live video on him yet, but I did check the portal. I like the two moves, the finisher and the perp move, that cycle together with the um, kick out. I think he'll be perfectly good for a uh, Hall of Fame. I have suggested to people is maybe this is not a month to like hard pass on. Um, you know, Hall of Fame tokens are hard to come by and you want to try and max these guys out if you can. So one thing that I did and it did count as part of talent up was take Iron Sheik Q five star bronze. Um, you'll have to watch my other quick video as to why any sane person would do that. <laughs> Okay, so starting small, we're going to move Seamus up because of his botch gem training ability. That's why. That's why I'm moving him up. I want the more botch gem damage. And uh, that is for Sako running the botch build. So we're going to go, go ahead and enhance Seamus. So Undertaker I've been pushing because I like his 9k trainer ability. He get does not only protect gems do 40% more, but you get one more protect. I don't know that I'll take him to 12,000, but I'm definitely going to move him up just for the 9k ability. So I've kind of taken a different approach to talent ups. I've really been pushing my trainers at the bottom end and then my higher guys and women at the other end. Okay, next up we have John Cena. I don't really plan to use this character much as a character, but as a coach, he's rather important. I will be using him on Godfather Hall of Fame with those countdown gem buffs. Uh, so he's definitely going up to 9k right now. So Vet Cena, away you go. There you go. So next up we have Apex Predator. And he is going up because I do have Riddle. So I'm definitely going to push him. Looking good. And next up, of course, to accompany Apex Predator, we're going to push Riddle. And we're going to basically every talent up, I'm going to keep pushing these two up together. Uh, when Apex gets there, Riddle will be right there with them. And uh, take advantage of all that awesome coaching ability. Next up, this is a move I've been looking forward to, the Godfather Hall of Fame. Uh, I think Hall, Hall, of Fame's token, bleh, Hall of Fame tokens count, and this is a good month to do him, given it's Hall of Fame month. So here we go. Nice. Okay, so next up we've got our Stevie Ray, NWO Hollywood. A lot of fun. Like this character quite a bit. He is definitely going up to gold and then obviously five stars. Okay, I've been looking forward to this move for quite some time. I really, really do need a five-star gold female, and Naomi is it. She's awesome. I could have pushed Lashley, but Zombie Lashley, but I already have Batista five-star gold, and he's doing just fine. Uh, so I figured I'd just pivot over to Naomi here. So quite happy with this move. I know she scales up really well, and she's quite the wrecker in feud. And as you see... um. Mm, I think her finisher, yeah, at max level, which I'm going to do right now, even though it's a 1,000 TP, makes a 3 by 2 area to protect. Okay, well, it looks like that did it for Talon Up. Um, I, I actually went a little over, so I'll, I'll carry the moves I didn't do over to next month. No big deal. Uh, I'm kind of happy with the moves I made, and I'm just going to collect Milestone. And I think this is the last Milestone where I get a... 
coin for a skill plate of my choosing, which is cool. Well, thanks for watching. Best of luck with your MLC talent up. I think uh, Dusty looks like a pretty good chase character. Take care. Cheers.